Off we go. At least it's not winter here or else I'll be freezing my ass off. And what is that, Lavington? <laughs> Thank you for your tireless work keeping us safe, my good guardsmen. This young lady was of great assistance to my to to me and my Pokemon, so I hope you forgive my bringing her into the village for a bit. <laughs> he smiles so cute. Oh, I look petrified, bro. This reminds me of like a Naruto village. And then the person behind that office. I told Tyler that little like the Hokage here. <laughs> This way, if you please. Aww. Jubilee Village it comes a long way thanks to the fine people of the Galaxy, Galaxy Expedition Team. This road where... It, what? Sorry, I hope you guys are reading what he's saying because I'm, I'm kind of like entranced by everything. <laughs> entranced by everything as these people gossip about me. Now the impressive building up ahead of us is Galaxy Hall, headquarters for this entire outfire. Who's that with the professor? Okay, he is a professor. Oh, botheration, I'd almost forgotten. I need to go and report that we successfully recovered the escape Pokemon. Might I ask you to wait for me at the canteen? It's just past this bridge here, then to the left the wallflower it's called. Oh, how, what a cute name. Wait, hello? Somehow it seems to show you where you need to go next. Uh, use the minus button to view the map on your arc phone. You can consult the map for guidance to your destination and information on your missions and requests. Once you... Uh, you'll also see, sorry, guidance markers when you're out exploring or running around the village. If you're not sure where to go next, stop and look around in all directions. Try to spot these markers and head for it. How convincing. Do I, does my girl have a double chin or is just that just a weird... <laughs> Sunlight angle. Hello, Blammy. I'm pretty new to the village myself. I try to talk to. Wow, dude, interesting glasses, the way it's being held up. Interesting. I try to talk to everyone I meet, so I always learn something new. Oh, nice to meet you. Alright, gotta go to Wallflower. Hello, Grandpa. Grandma. Grandpa? Whoa, why is he looking at me like that? Is this mustache green? Benny? Well, now aren't you awfully suspicious? <laughs> My girl! The wallflower is for galaxy team folk only. We don't have seats for outsiders. Move along. Damn! The distraught on my face! <gasps> the guy! Who in the world are you? And what's with that bizarre garb you're wearing? How rude. I'm not falling in love with you. <laughs> A Pokemon could slice through those tiny- those- those- <laughs> through those flimsy excuses for clothes. Well, excuse me, moi. <laughs> hmm, for you to get in here, someone must have vouched for you. What's it Professor Leventon? Do you two know each other? He's from a region a long way off. Not the most reliable sort, though. Letting Pokemon run off and give him the slip and all. Three more of them got away just a while ago. If I hadn't been resting up after some Pokemon drugged me with a move called Thundershock, uh, I'd have corralled him for sure. But the Professor, well, I did it. Unfortunately, it's just as Ray says. I'm a clumsy sort of Ray. Is that Ray or Rye? I'm assuming Ray? <laughs> I'm a clumsy sort of fellow, to put it mildly. I love how expressive they are. But everything will be quite alright now. Michiko here, here has agreed to help us with our Pokédex. <laughs> I really love how expressive they are. He's like, he looked at me like, Bitch, what? You? <laughs> As in, she's going to join his survey corps? What makes you think that's a good idea? We can't just take any misfit who- MISFIT?! Who- Alright, Timmy number two! <laughs> oh, the wilderness. I'll allow it. That's Hokage, right? 
assuming the in individual can contribute to the survey corpse, that is. I am the captain of the Galaxy Team Survey Corps. You may call me Celine. I hope I'm pronouncing these guys' names right. If I'm incorrect, I'm so sorry. What kind of shoes are those? <laughs> my my attention span. Professor Lavinson has told me how you helped secure his Pokemon when they slipped his control, and now it seems he would like us to feed and house you in exchange for your ongoing labor. That's right. You look to be fifteen or so. Always, we're always fucking fifteen. We're never growing out of fifteen. Ugh. <laughs> Fighting. Quite old enough to work for your keep. Oh, what the. <laughs> But we can't simply take on a stranger who wanders in among us without any idea of their skills or origins. Tomorrow we shall see if you can prove yourself worthy. A most reasonable decision, Captain. Now, would you care to join us for a meal? I'm sure you've got plenty of questions for our visitor. That's quite alright. I prefer to eat alone so I might appreciate my meals without distraction. But we're going in there too, what? Aloof as always, I see. Well, no matter. The rest of us can share a meal and some pleasant conversations then. <laughs> Benny old chum, the usual potato. Oh, <gasps> potato mochi! If you please. I love mochi and I love potatoes. I'm sure that tastes delicious. But make it for three today. Can I see it? <gasps> oh, I can see it. Wonderful stuff, Benny. Much obliged. Your potato mochi never failed to please. Why'd you find a stranger in the first place, Professor? Yo, I love this game so much already. Just how, like... Uh, it's so... It's so... You know? <laughs> it's... Uh, I'm excited. I, to think I didn't even want to play this game. Because it didn't show much of the story mode. It showed off, like, catching Pokemon, running away from Pokemon, all that stuff. But I really love how they're just so expressive. And just, you know, so much movement. <laughs> Ah, uh, well, you know, that great hole in the sky, the one people call the space-time rift. Our new friend fell out- wait, I fell out from that? How? It's all the way over there by the mountains. Our new friend fell right out of it. Yo, that looks so fucking good. The food and the dishware. Look, <laughs> Ray is like, what? <laughs> Was that a joke? Come now, I am a scientist. My job is to observe and explain any and all phenomena. I concern myself only with facts. Now, you already know there are many Pokemon here in the Hisui region. Sure, they're all over the place. In the grass, in the forest, in the ocean. It's up to- Oh god, the ocean. <laughs> I don't want to go in there. It's up to us in the survey courts to study them and figure out what kind of creatures they are. Well, we know this much. Pokemon are terrifying creatures. It's all but impossible to know what kinds of powers they might possess or what sorts of wondrous things they can do. But that's where Machika will come in. <laughs> I look so cute! She successfully caught three Pokemon, three of them in quick order, you understand? Nobody in the Galaxy team is capable of a feat such as that. This means we can finally begin our Pokemon research in earnest. Ugh, oh, even though, like, the, the little sound effects of like change of yeah whatever guys i'm just fangirling over the smallest details <laughs> that's really something we count ourselves lucky when we manage to catch what a single wild pokemon Psh. Psh. i'm gonna climb the ranks so fast <laughs> while fending off their attacks now what a perfect fair the pokemon that fled to the beach were on the attack that's true but the key to catching pokemon is getting close enough to hear your pokeball well and it seems our new friend is fearless enough to do just that does the survey, survey corpse really have the leeway to be enjoying a le leisurely meal with this outsider? Listen, Benny! Is your hair really green? <laughs> your captain just ordered 10 whole portions of potato mochi, you know? The slow progress in the Pokedex of yours clearly has her on edge. 10? I'm sure we'll start to rein in the good captain's stress any soon enough. Now have your fill, Michigo. And think, if you make it into the galaxy team, you'll never have to worry about a meal again. Shit, okay, for food and free lodging, as long as I just catch a bunch of Pokemon, easy. <laughs> the team provides for all its members' needs, even if said members fell out of the sky. Oh, it's so pretty. That was quite delicious, quite delicious indeed. You're awfully relaxed about all this. You do know that we won't get to have Michiko join the Survey Corps unless she passes a trial. Not to worry, I have complete confidence in Chico's skill. 
Let's hope it's not misplaced. And Chico was it. For tonight, at least we will provide you with a place to sleep. You may also use our quarters there. Where? There? But if you fail to pass the trial we put to we we'll put to you tomorrow, you must move on. You will be expelled from the village to meet your fate and perhaps your death in the wild. Okay. <laughs> Alright. Don't sugarcoat anything. No, oh, my girl's face! Captain Celine's like Hisui in a way. But Hisui, they're both plenty harsh. Now, now, she simply puts on a stern front to help us to help keep us all safe. At any rate, I think it's time we turned in for the night, eh? It's a good thing one can't fall out with the futons we sleep in here. Imagine our new friend hasn't had enough falling for one day. And with that, I bid you both a good night. Yeah, sleep tight. Oh, you're being nice to me now? <laughs> Still, people falling from the sky, that's some kind of story. Can I talk to grandmas and grandpas? Hello, Troy. Now, who might you be? I haven't seen you in the village before. Hmm. Troy, you do, has anyone told you like a snake, fang, or a vampire? Oh my god, controller, I know you're about to die. Should I switch up? <laughs> Toma? The captain of the survey corps, Selena. I wonder if anything actually scares her. Let me switch up my controller real quick. And now I'm playing on my joy cons. Hello? This is all to me? This is all to myself? Wow. All mine? This chest looks like you could store lots and lots of items in it. A nice fire in the sunken earth can help keep the entire room clean. Is this dresser a very solid construction where extra sets of clothing is going to be? Did I take off my shoes? Did my girl not wear any shoes? Yeah, she took them off. Good girl. <laughs> Is a jelly use to store drinking water. It has a lid on top to keep debris from falling in. Survey tips contains all sorts of useful information to help you carry out your survey work in the Hisui region. To read them at any time, simply press the up button to open the menu and then the help screen. Handy tips for team members. Don't wish your toils to be forgotten. Diligent record keeping will save you from such a fate. Uh, save your progress, press the up button to open the menu, then scroll with the ZL or ZR button until you reach the save screen. There's also an autosave function you can use to have your progress save automatically. You can enable or disable autosave by scrolling to the help screen in the menu, then selecting settings. Okay. Investigate this light. It's a paper lantern. It seems to use fuel. Use oil as its fuel. These, uh, there are some lovely stones that someone must have found, but they, they're just plain old stones. It's a full-length mirror. Uh, our prince, five principles. Behave with courtesy to others. Superiors are owed your respect. Likes and dislikes are a luxury ill afforded. Oh, that kind of hurts. <laughs> that one's kind of hits a little. Those who are weaker must be helped. Difficulties must be faced head on. Okay. Well, I think I explored everything, so let's go rest. Rest until tomorrow morning? Yes. I want new clothes. Come on, man. Holy shit, what the hell's happening? Like, Bidoof! My Joy-Con is like, vibrating like crazy. Oh! Is that true on fire? The next day. Hey! Hey in there, you awake? That was a wild lightning last night, right? Anyway, if you're out, come on out. <laughs> I have a name, Ray. My shoes automatically got put on my feet. <laughs> Do you sleep all right? I know that's not easy in a strange new land. 
We better- am I taller than him? <laughs> we better not keep Captain Gasoline waiting. Let's hurry to headquarters. I wonder what a star they would look like. What? You never been outside? Ooh, it's fancy in here. Sounds like gym battle music. Here we are, Galaxy Hall. What do you think? Ever seen a building this grand before? Don't give up. Keep those eyes open. Vassell, who's Vassell? The wild, your, your jewel, the wild Pokemon, they, they were everywhere attacking from all sides. I sent out my partner Pokemon, but against the whole pack, outnumbered. This is what happens when you go ahead, uh, go so far afield. But the medical corpse will put you to rights. You uh, do realize that if you fail your trial and get flung out of the village, you would you could well die out there. Well, you might die even sooner than that if you have to take on this trial without a Pokemon to be your partner. Are you trying to cheer me on or not? <laughs> Captain Selene Nana brought me Chico. You can't tell me this is not look like a Hokage room. You may enter. 